guys, happy Vlogmas Day 17. It is crazy how fast Vlogmas is going, but I'm kind of happy about it just because it is a lot of effort, um, even though it's not anything crazy, like editing a vlog still takes a lot of time out of your day, especially when you're trying to like spend time with, you know, family while you're at home. Um, but I hope you guys don't mind that I've been combining days a lot. Um, it just works out for me and I'm still vlogging every day, so. It's honestly kind of hard to get content when you're literally not doing anything for the whole day. So I try to plan like things every other day so that I can have like some bit of content. But hopefully as it gets closer to Christmas, there'll be a lot more single day vlogs. I'm hoping that I'll have like more content to vlog about. Um, but today we are doing something very important. It's a big day in my life. Um, we're waxing my sideburns. I was looking at myself in the mirror last night and I just like kind of thought what would happen if I didn't have these sideburns. So I kind of went back and looked at a lot of other girls like on Instagram, like Nezanine Kavari. Her sideburns like don't exist and I feel like for some reason I think I remember her saying she gets them like lasered. So I don't know if you guys have watched my vlogs before where I wax my face but I do wax all my peach fuzz off but today we're just gonna go ahead and do the sideburns also because I'm running out of wax so I don't know if I even have that much to wax my whole face with it'll do um but I use the Gigi strip free wax and I got this off of Amazon and I saw it in Sally for like two bucks more so like if you really want to get in the store then like whatever but you can get it on Amazon and then you buy popsicle sticks or today I'm using plastic knives because I don't know where my popsicle sticks are and I'm also at home so I don't have everything. Um, but I found some plastic knives so that should work fine. Um, and yeah, I'm going to hope for the best because I don't know what I'm doing. Also, I have a lazy eye so when it gets to this side, like it's really hard for me to see because this one like is really hard to see out of. That's like TMI but... Fun fact about me, I'm lazy eye. Okay, let's start waxing. I'm gonna try to tie my hair in like a really tight ponytail so I really know where, what sideburns to wax and what not to wax. So for all you loyal subscribers out there that have watched every vlog of mine, I'm so sorry that I literally wear this sweatshirt in every video, but like that's just the realness of Vlogmas. Like you vlog every day, well I wear this damn sweatshirt every day, so alright guys, I think it's time. I'm also getting a little impatient, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go. I think I'm gonna start like by layers because it's gonna hurt if I do it all at once. sideburn hair so I don't know why I didn't think about this beforehand but I'm just gonna go ahead and trim it and then wax it would make more sense but no I just want myself to go through more pain than I should <laughs> literally Ryan just snapchatted me I'll put it on the screen right here <laughs> he said you're supposed to shave and cut them bef before and then wax that little hairs after Wow, look at me. Why Why does he know this? Why, why do I not know this? <laughs> oh, I'm embarrassed now. So I did it and I feel so like, I feel like bald right now. Like, this is insane. I don't know if I like it. I'm kind of like shook right now. I don't even know. This is sideburns and this is not sideburns. I think it'll grow on me, but it's hard. I don't know. I feel like a naked mole rat. So this is what it looks like after I waxed off all my sideburns. So as you can see, like, I waxed all that, but I have, like, these baby hairs. So it kind of covers it. This one's, like, a lot thicker on the side. I don't get it. But 
I do wish that I didn't wax so high because I looked at other pictures and like people's like sideburns stopped here and then went behind their ear but I mean I'll just try to like train it after it grows out to be like that so I'll just like wax it like that once it grows back out um but I mean I think you know I feel like a I feel like a new person I feel super super soft so. I just finished my makeup and I'm trying Ryan's face on me. Doesn't look that bad actually. Thanks. You like it? Yeah. It was like weird putting on makeup because like I had to put makeup like all the way like over here, you know? I think you need a little bit of a sideburn. Yeah, I know. I that's what I was saying. Like, I think it needs to come down over here and then stop right there and go back up. You know. What? I agree. Like sound, like my sound, my car. Like, look how bald this is. Okay, why did you go up under your hip there? I didn't mean to, but it'll grow back. It's fine. This will hide it. I'm fine with it. Did you actually wax that long ass hair out? Yeah, I did, and it hurt really bad. You're not supposed to do that. I know, and literally once I got your Snapchat, I already had the scissors out, and I was like, why did I not do this? <laughs> it hurt. I wouldn't even grow back right then. You ripped the like, roots like, all the way out of your hair. Good to know. So the last step of getting ready is doing my hair, and today I'm going to curl it. I don't know where my wand is, but I have this clamp one, which I don't love. You need to find that one because I'm getting really pissed off with this freaking clamp. I do not know how to use it and it's just not working out for me. So I need my wand back. I might have left it in Athens. That's what I'm thinking because I don't know where the freak it could be. So I'm done with my everyday look. Um, the only thing that I don't really do on an everyday basis is the shimmer on my eyelid. But I just threw that in there because I felt like it today. Um, but I used the Dolce K lip liner from Kylie on my lips with lip gloss. Um, and yeah, so this is my look for today. Um, I have to film some videos and I need to, but I'm feeling so lazy. Um, but I haven't eaten and it's almost two. So I think I'm gonna go make some avocado toast. It's finally sunny outside. Atlanta and Georgia in general has like a bad curse of gray skies this winter. So I'm enjoying my avocado toast outside. Um, and I definitely wanna like be outside more while it's 
sunny because I just can't with this daylight savings time. I just can't. I feel like I need to go to sleep at 5. So I'm going to try to maybe edit outside or do something outside and then maybe film when it gets darker. Also, I used Hawaiian bread for my avocado toast. They make Hawaiian bread. Like, not the Hawaiian rolls, but the bread. And, oh my god, this is like my favorite meal ever. Avocado toast with that kind of bread with my blueberry lemonade. Like, probably super unhealthy, but like, I'm just going to treat myself because I saw the Hawaiian bread at Walmart and I was like, oh my god, like, not every grocery store has it. So, I just thought might as well get it. So I'm outside in the backyard, that's why you hear um, that loud pool noise. Realized that my laptop wasn't charged, so I decided to just like work inside, um, but I think I might bring it out now since it's charged now. So I wanted to ask you guys like a couple of questions and you can kind of just feed into the conversation in the comments down below. But I was wondering if you guys like vlogs over main channel videos. Like I don't have a main channel, but you know, the more highly produced videos and with my big Canon 70D instead of like the vlog camera quality or like what do you guys want to see because especially for the new year the more highly produced videos I think are you know take more time they're harder to um, you know set up like vlogging style is way more convenient for me um, and I don't want to put out content that you guys don't really want to see. Like I've said in the past, I do vlogs for me to keep my memories somewhere. Um, but for the main channel videos, that's not really for me. That's just helping you guys understand something or teaching you guys how to do something like makeup or advice videos. But that's not really for me. So do you guys want to see that or do you guys just want to see vlogs? Do you want to see day in my life? So, like, what do you guys like to see? when you watch YouTube at night. Let me know in the comments down below because it would be such a help to me to plan out my content for the next year and just to kind of know you guys better. Um, I feel like I'm growing my subscriber base and a lot of you guys comment consistently on my videos and it makes me so happy to have those loyal subscribers who like watch all my videos because for me, I have so many favorite YouTubers that I watch every single one of their videos, so it just kind of makes me motivated to create more content for you guys. So any help or constructive criticism about my channel would be very, very helpful. I started on YouTube as a beauty guru and I feel like it's just not where my heart's at anymore. I love makeup still, don't get me wrong, like I love beating my face. It's something to look forward to in the morning, um, getting ready and stuff like that, but I don't know, sometimes just filming myself getting ready. It honestly makes me stressed out more than happy. But if you guys still want to see it, then I will definitely do more makeup videos for you guys. So if you guys want to chime in on, you know, kind of your feedback on my channel, that'd be really, really great. And I would love and appreciate that so, so much. So go ahead and leave me a comment down below. Hey guys, happy Vlogmas Day 18. Today we are starting off the day by doing some errands. I need my nails done and then I need to go to the grocery store because I'm having a little holiday party here. Um, it's going to be a potluck so I'm making pasta and then other people are bringing other stuff. So later tonight we can see what they brought but I'm really excited to just be eating like like junk food. I mean it's not going to be junk food but just like dessert food and like yummy just snacky food because literally the past three days I kid you not I have been eating butter chicken. Or like Indian food and like that's great and all but like I just need a break a little bit. So before I go I wanted to do a little OOTD. So I got this top at TJ Maxx and I literally wear it like so often. It's really really nice like material and it has these cute little arm sleeve things and it just like adds a lot to it. Then I have the Sphinx leather leggings and then I'm going to change my shoes into some chunky white sneakers because I think that would look cool so I'm gonna do that my all my shoes are in my car because it just makes more sense since I'm like bouncing around everywhere I just changed my shoes into these shoes they're from Steve Madden So I'm back at home, I'm gonna enjoy a little bit more of the outdoors just like yesterday. I got some sushi from Publix and it looks really, really good. I'm really not sure what all is on top of it. Gonna eat this and watch some YouTube. I also got my nails done. This is the color Coconuts over OPI. And I think it's really pretty. I love it. So it is currently five something 
I just know that because it's sun setting. And Ryan's here. Should I keep this beard? Comment below. Like it looks fine, but I feel like whenever you shave it or like do something different, I'm like, oh, that's cute. Like you look cute in many different ways. <laughs> My friends are coming over and we're having a potluck and I'm making pasta carbonara. Pretty sure I already told you guys this, but we're gonna get started on that. It's 7.27 and they are supposed to be here by eight. <laughs> I said literally eight and I know they're gonna run late. So I told them like 8.20 latest because I want them to eat my pasta fresh and warm. Meat and love. Maybe it's a pot filler. What the hell? Yeah, yeah, it's pretty cool. Wait, what the hell? <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing. Technology, wow. Look at this. I'm scared. That's so cool. Ah. Wowzers. Mm -hmm. Hi! Hello! Hi! Hola! Hola! Konnichiwa! Got some wine. Actually, it would be Konnichiwa. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh. <laughs> no one cares. And the pasta's cooking. Make the sound of a pop. Do it. <laughs> Do it again. Wait. That was pretty good, honestly. <laughs> no, that sucked. Oh, there she got it. <laughs> <laughs> that sucked. <laughs> pasta's all done. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. Oh guys, these corners are perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing it! <laughs> oh yes. Okay, cheers. Cheers. Everybody get your phone out so we can all take a photo. Cheers One, to two. prosperity and health. Three. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.